So we're running our microwave on our 500 amp hour batteries. As you can see, the voltage right now is 25.5. The fridge is also on, so we have the fridge. Can you hear it? And I'll take you out to the microwave. And here is the microwave oven. Ishan? Hello. And here's the microwave running. And it started to run for 23 minutes the first cycle. And it's been running, so 23, take away 9, it's been running for about 14 minutes. Okay, now you hear it. When it makes that sound, our inverter kind of starts making noise because it's asking for a lot of power. And you can see the lights kind of are blinking a little bit. So I'll take it back out. Microwaves don't run constantly. They run and then they stop. They run and they stop. And you can see we're trying to defrost food in there. Okay, so I'll take you back out to the inverter and we'll see what the battery is saying, okay? That was my mother. The batteries are still 25.6 volts. So the batteries actually went up from when we started. So what it's showing is a combination of the panels producing electricity and we're not taking that much out of it. So now we're back to 25.5. Um, our load is welcome. Input abnormal, which means there's no napper. Uh, we're producing 221, 15% and our battery is at 25.8. That's what the inverter says. My load meter says the batteries are 25.6. So these batteries have been charging for the last three days. I want to discharge them a little bit. That's why I'm running the microwave and the fridge at the same time.